Hello, it's me, Crazy Rebecca Dances with Pitbulls. Welcome to part six of my Let's Make a Crazy Quilt series. Today we are making smaller blocks like this out of these smaller pieces that we've been saving. And these also okay we need since most of our blocks are 10 inch or whatever you, you got to do some math my blocks are 10 inch so I need five and a half inch blocks because you have to take into account the seam allowance one two three four one two three four five and a half My scissors. If you want to use a rotary cutter, go for it. I'm doing the old uh, riptastic thing. So I'm thinking something wasn't quite square. So, one, two, three, four, five, and I am okay. Well, we can trim it. We can trim. Ain't nothing but a thing. One, two, three, four, five, and a half. We'll do four of these. I hope to get eight eventually. All right, see, that's a little bit. Okay, let's just not stress about the size because we can trim them, right? We can trim them when they're done. And I think, let's see, I gotta get my iron turned on and I gotta thread some needles because I'm gonna do it by hand. Okay, so I've got my needle thread, I'm using up old thread so You'll recognize this from one of the squares we made so let's just put that in the middle like that now we're taking smaller pieces <laughs> really smaller. <laughs> Just this is one I hacked up. So maybe you just want to do a bunch of little squares. You just cut your strips smaller when you're starting. Maybe cut your bigger pieces into quarters. So um, Julie is doing greens and purples, and Jane is doing orange and pinks, and Lottie Faith is doing rainbow brights. <laughs> rainbow brights. So I'm looking forward to seeing if anybody gets anything done, what it looks like, because I want to know, dang it. Let's use this black on this one. Yeah, it's kind of, yeah, not that one. Okay, this one. 
I'm going to do two in a row because then I just bring the iron over and get both of these flip, sewn and flip, flip and sew, sew and flip. I forget how you say it. And these will look so complicated and people are going to think you're a genius. Which you are. Don't let anybody tell you you're not. Now I have my iron right here to my right. You may have to set up a little ironing station beside your sewing machine. I have a little rolling cart that I can move if I'm when I'm seriously sewing and I'm not trying to film. It sits right to the right, and I can just sew, pivot, iron, pivot back and sew. Okay, so this is going to be a piece. What should I do? You have to do it that way. And. this. We got those sewed. Now your shapes are different because you're not having that, you know, a strip. And this triangle You're going to have to learn to deal with triangles, too. So we're going to go ahead and find... Wait a minute, what is that? Okay. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and find something to fit here. You know, now I could use this because I can do... that. Okay, so we'll do... that for that one. And... this for that one. I'm sewing, sewing off camera. Okay, I had gone ahead, oops, camera, camera, and switched over to machine sewing because I didn't want to thread any more needles because I'm lazy, lazy. to trim like so. So. But you just keep adding your small pieces. I 
this can go here like that you just keep going around now you may have to put two blacks beside each other that's fine it's fine people just fit it in there like a jigsaw puzzle Yes. Okay, so I'm going to keep building around and around. And when I get done, I'll show you what I have accomplished with my scrappage. Yes. Okay, here I have my first two smaller blocks. Don't think I'm going to get four, <laughs> but you never know. I'll just use up some bigger pieces if I don't get four. Oh, no, I, okay. I still have all this. Okay. <laughs> Stand down. Rebecca doesn't know what she's talking about. So I'll be back when I get four. So with much whining and crying, <laughs> I finally got four blocks done. There's no way I had enough for eight. And quite frankly, I'm tired of fighting with it, so I'm just going to call it four, call it good. Next step is to sew them together into one block. And here we have our block. Is it the same size as one of these? Yes, it is. So maybe you want to make, I don't know, depending on your scrappage, at least a couple of these. Um, I haven't decided exactly what we're going to do yet, if it's going to be a full quilt. I think it'll depend on how much I can get embroidered, but these are definitely these definitely add to your crazy quilt so let me know how you're doing and come back I don't know what I'm doing next I just don't know I think I'll do some embroidery stitches look at me are you kidding me situation normal <laughs>